Hi, I'm Dr. Paul Hafner, and welcome to the next installment of Sports Psych in a Minute. Today, what I'd like to do is to address one of the most frequently asked questions, which is, what do I do when I find that something unexpected happens or I make a mistake to get myself back on track? A lot of times when things happen like that, when we're in the middle of a dressage test or a jumping round or we're out on a cross country course, we find ourselves caught in this negative thinking loop where we get anxious and worried about the mistake we made and maybe we get self-critical about that and it's a, a way in which we can very easily take ourselves out of the game. So what can you do to get yourself back in the game really, really quickly? I'm going to talk with you today about what is called the idiomotor response. What the idiomotor response refers to is that really, really strong connection between what we imagine and what goes on physiologically in our bodies. So take a minute, close your eyes. I want you to think about walking into a kitchen. And as you walk into the kitchen, you're struck by this wonderful aroma of perhaps your favorite cookies baking in the oven or pies baking, or maybe you walk in, smell your favorite meal cooking. If you're like most people, if you think about it now, you may notice that you've already started to salivate. For many people, there is a immediate and automatic connection between the imagery, and in the imagery, this case being both visual and olfactory, and a physiological response of salivation. The really cool thing is that we can use this to help us in competition or at any time when we get caught off guard by something, we find ourselves making a mistake or we find ourselves drifting into that negative thinking cycle. What we do is, as we talked about last week, we first have to identify what is it that we want to be feeling, thinking, doing? We have to identify the performance state, state of mind, feeling state, however you want to describe it, that we want to have, that we want to come back to when we have one of these moments where we've made an error or something unexpected happen. Once we know what we want to feel, what mindset, mind state we want to be in, then it's just a matter of finding a image, a mental image, that for us symbolizes that feeling state. Then, when we're in that situation, we kick up our image, it brings up that positive performance state, and we get back on track. So let me give you two examples of how this has been used by riders that I've worked with in the past. The first one is a rider who came to me and had uh, difficulty with tension, getting tense over very specific kinds of jumps. In general, they were performing really, really well, but over these specific types of jumps, they found that they would get tense and they'd be more prone to coming out of the tack uh, enough to really affect their performance overall. What we worked on was talking about what was that feeling in their, in their body they wanted to have over those jumps. They identified a softness and suppleness, and for them, that was connected to an image of melting butter. And they went one step further and actually put a phrase to it, which was pure butter baby. Okay? So, Going into a jump that's been a difficulty for them in the past, several strides out, image of melting butter, pure butter baby, physiological response of softness and suppleness, problem solved. One other example, I worked with a dressage rider once who used to get caught in these negative thinking cycles as soon as they realized that they made a mistake, and often it could be a very small mistake. And when we talked about what they wanted to have in the, in the ring in those moments is that they wanted to have this sort of focused sense of confidence. Now, I may be dating myself, but the image that came to mind was a cartoon I used to watch frequently as a kid 
which was that of Mighty Mouse. And if you've ever seen Mighty Mouse, when he changes into his superhero costume, he's standing there, his chest is all puffed out, and he sings this little ditty, it goes something like, here I come to save the day. So, next time that happened, Ryder connected that image to those positive, confident feelings. Make a mistake in a dressage test. Mighty Mouse comes to mind. Smile comes across their face. Confidence in their body and a confident feeling in their heart. And boom, problem solved. So, idiomotor response. Play with it. Use some creativity. See what you can come up with to connect to those kinds of powerful performance states you want to bring into your competition when something unexpected happens or you get temporarily derailed. Have some fun with it. Come up with ideas. Feel free to share them in the comments below. This has been Sports Psych in a Minute, and we'll see you next week.